Hey guys, it's Greg. Welcome back to the channel. Today, we're going to be counting down my top 10 80s riffs. Now I know what you're thinking. But Greg, top 10 80s riffs? I don't even like 80s riffs. Do I even have to watch this stupid video? Shut up and don't be silly. Everybody likes 80s. So yeah, you do. You're welcome. All right, 80s riffs. Everybody knows them. Everybody loves them. I could probably do a video on the top 1,000, but we don't have enough time for that. We're only doing 10. So again, this is just my personal top 10. If you disagree with me, go ahead and me, 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 me in the comments. That's fine. But these are my top 10. All right. We'll be counting down from 10 all the way to one. Imagine that. Saving the best three for last. I don't really have these ranked, but I'm kind of just saving my favorite three for last. All right. So before you me, 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 just know that. All right. To get my 80s tone, I'm going to be using my Harley Benton Fusion SSP loaded with bare knuckle True Grit pickups. My trusty Marshall DSL-20 boosted with my Boss SD-1 coming out of my Ingle 212 with V30s. And we're micing this up with an SM57. All right, let's get to the countdown. All right, coming in at number 10 is one of the best, biggest, and most awesome arena rock 80s riffs of all time. Rock You Like a Hurricane by The Scorpions. Number nine, we're looking at my favorite riff by one of the best 80s bands ever. I don't care what you say. We're doing Painkiller by Judas Priest. Okay, number eight. Again, one of the best arena rock riffs of all time. Just one of the best riffs of all time. Look at that. Welcome to the Jungle by Guns N' Roses. All right, number seven is Youth Gone Wild by the awesome Skid Row. This has to be the best riff they ever wrote, by the way. Number six is by far the best Alice Cooper riff ever written, and just a really awesome, catchy lead riff. We're looking at Poison by Alice Cooper. Number five, what's the best Motley Crue riff ever, you say, Greg? I'm glad you asked. It's Kickstart My Heart. Number four, the best winger song ever written, one of the best and catchiest riffs ever written in the history of mankind. It's 17 by Winger. Alright, top three time. Number three, just did a video on this. If you haven't seen it, when you finish this, go check it out. This is Still the Night by Whitesnake. One of the best riffs of the entire 80s and one of the best songs and one of the best bands. Number 
two left. Who are you building up to, Greg? Oh my god. Well, see the shirt? It's Unchained by Van Halen. So the number one spot, I've done all the obvious ones except for one. What is the ultimate 80s riff? I'm glad you asked. <laughs> it's Lay It Down by Rat, the greatest and one of the weirdest and one of the coolest riffs ever written in the history of mankind and definitely one of the best, if not the best, of the entire 80s. You're welcome. <laughs> So that'll do it for this video, guys. What do you think? Do you agree with my top 10? Or are you, me, 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 those are totally wrong, and I hate everything you just did. Let me know in the comments below. Comment your top 10 80s riffs, all right? As always, like, share, subscribe. Tell your friends, your worst enemies, people alive, dead, in this dimension, and the next about the channel. And I'll see you in the next video. Yeah,